Hi guys, this is Jason and in this video I'll be showing you step by step how you can combine affiliate marketing on YouTube. I'll show you where to get the video, I'll show you how to do the video keyword research and I'll also show you how to get the customers. But before I do all that, I would really appreciate it if you would hit the like button and also subscribe if you haven't already as I release daily videos on how to start making money online. The affiliate network we'll be using will be Clickbank. As you can see, I've already logged into Clickbank. You will, the beauty about Clickbank is majority of their products are ebooks or digital products and it's very easy to promote and they are also, they also have a very good payout. The niche I'll be using in this video will be in the home and garden niche and under the pet, the pet niche overall. As you can see, for the brain training for dogs, you'll be getting $31 for each sale that you, that you get. And here's an example of their sales page. They develop the dog's brains, the dog's intelligence. And it involves all of, and it's all about dog training. The buyer will learn how to put control their dog. So okay, now we have seen the product that we'll be advertising. So how will you be getting the video? Well, for that, I recommend Instagram. Instagram is one of the best sources to get free videos. While you cannot use these videos to get monetized, you can definitely use them for affiliate marketing. And I've already went on the Explorer page and searched for dog videos. As you can see, there are lots of them. I recommend that you combine like two or, two or three of these videos. To download them, I would simply click on the video, click the three icons right there, and click on copy link. And paste the link in this website here that I'll, I'll leave in the description. One of the pull box of this website though is that it has a lot of ads. more ads again okay you can see a preview of the video here we we'll simply click there and download Okay, so now we have downloaded the video, but I also recommend that you add audio to the video. And to add audio, we normally use the YouTube audio library for free copyright video, free copyright songs. 
I already went in pre the video and downloaded a song. And the software I will be using to make the video at, the time, at this moment will be Windows Movie Maker 10. If you are using an Apple laptop, you can also use iMovie. And Windows Movie, Movie Maker 10 is completely free. A second while I search for the video. Here's our video. Now let's add some audio. Let's search for the audio. Otherwise, some of the audio would also had some text overlay. For instance, you'd write a you'd write a text below the video that that says, "Click the link down below for the best for the best dog training tips." Something intriguing to pull in your customers. Just editing the text here, the audio here. As I say, I would recommend that you combine like two or three of the Instagram videos, making your video like two to three minutes long. After we have done all that, we we'll click on save video. Okay, so we have done all that. What's next? Next we will search for tags that we can use for our title and we'll also search for tags that we can put in our description. As you can see the, the tool that I use to search for titles and tags is TubeBuddy. It's a free plugin. You can see that this search, this shows that how to train your dog to be calm gets actually 90 searches per month and is a good keyword to target and you can see here it shows you three other long term long keyword long term keywords that you can use and here is another example how to train your dog to poop in one one place inside this is also a good keyword to target so you could use either one of these keywords as your title and also add them in description and you'll get a few views But don't, it doesn't matter the quality of your title, <coughs> excuse me, or your video without a good, without a good thumbnail, you won't get any views. So for thumbnails, I normally use Canva, as you can see here. The reason why I use Canva is because it is very easy to use and it's beginner friendly.
and it's completely free also. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and also subscribe. Thank you.